truly glorious arrival. A multiple time champion around the world. There is no one else as glorious. I can think of some people. The following contest is in a Decade of title wins and main events for this man, Robert Roode. And I think you'll agree with me, Cole. Every time he competes, it is absolutely glorious. Here comes the awe-inspiring, high-flying Hall of Famer. And from Battle Creek, Michigan, weighing in at 235 pounds, Rob Van Dam. A man who lives his life way up high. The definition of unorthodox style, both in and out of the ring. His martial arts acumen is translated into quite the impressive, memorable sports entertainment career. We can only hope that RBD is about to make some more memorable moments here tonight. Here comes the Irish Ace of WWE. And representing the Judgment Day from Bray County, Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 180 pounds, J.D. McDonough. Trained by Finn Balor, inherited that same killer instinct. And McDonough's absolutely not here to make friends. He's here just to fight and win. I don't think J.D. could make a friend even if he tried. Well, if J.D.'s the Irish ace, I guess that makes you the Joker, Saxton. Or maybe that rules card that everyone just throws out. The Silent Man has arrived. Dexter Loomis is here. And from Recluse, Wyoming, weighing in at 230 pounds, Dexter Loomis! The eerie look in the eyes of Dexter Loomis. You gotta wonder what exactly is on his mind. It's a bold assumption that Loomis has a functioning mind, Saxton. I see nothing but deeply suppressed rage. The eyes.
eyes of an artist who will paint a picture of his victims before their match. Competitors dread seeing their image painted by Loomis. I wasn't going to say anything, but Loomis painted Saxton earlier today. He did? Wait, can I at least keep the painting? Sure, if you survive. Here comes the Austrian anomaly, Gunther. A man with one purpose, to prove the math sacred. And representing Imperium from Vienna, Austria, weighing in at 297 pounds, Gunther! Without question, Gunther has made an immediate impact since his arrival. A truly dominant specimen. And a specimen who is as ready as ever to chop clean through the competition. Hey, he puts others to the test. And they often come up short. He moves with such a purpose. Absolutely no wasted energy. Well, that's because Gunther is saving himself completely for the battle ahead. Yeah, but he does manage to make his entrance as intimidating as possible. From dashing to demented, Cody Rhodes is here. A horrible fate for this formerly handsome young man. And from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, Cody Rhodes! You know, once upon a time, Cody called himself dashing. Now he's consumed with ugliness. Yeah, he's even brought paper bags to the ring and demanded that fans in the crowd wear them. I'm surprised he hasn't made you wear one, Saxton. Well, if that was the case, you wouldn't hear me on commentary, Corey. I fail to see the problem there. Cody says he'll win tonight, or he will never show his face again. Is that a promise? I hope it is. No, oh, the king of hardcore. And from truth or consequences, New Mexico, weighing in at 287 pounds, Cactus Jack. Think about the history of Cactus Jacks, whose origins date back to both ECW and WCW, where he won tag team titles in both organizations. I think you meant origin, Saxton, but I understand everyone's <laughs> a little on edge when Cactus Jack's around. How'd you know? What I want to know is who would team with a man this dangerous? And when you're dealing with Cactus Jack, the rules are more like light suggestions.
Maybe the best big match wrestler of all time, Shawn Michaels. Introducing the champion, representing D-Generation X from San Antonio, Texas, weighing in at 227 pounds, the WWE Hardcore Wrestling Champion, the Heartbreak Kid, Shawn Michaels. Michaels has enjoyed a lengthy and impressive career defined by memorable and historic victories. A back-to-back -back Royal Rumble winner, the first ever Grand Slam champion, competed in the first ever ladder match. I hate to cut you off, Michael, but HBK's accolades could go on all night. He's a true inspiration, a shining light in this business. Eight superstars, one fall to a finish. I imagine the action is going to be fast and furious in this one. Oh, the rapid one.
effort glazed over. It's absolute pandemonium in here. And it's all because of the war power these superstars are showing. But right hands create separation and an escape. championship mindset going into this match and now he has the hardware to go along with it.